All right, thanks, Jason. Uh, hundreds of people going to be getting together this month for the Baldwin County Heart Walk, a celebration of life, while also having an opportunity to raise awareness and money for heart disease research. So I have Evan Duffy with me from the Heart Association to talk more about the event and why it's important for you to come. Thank you. Thanks for having me. <laughs> and wearing red. That's great. I had to represent today. Good. <laughs> so this year, well, and last year too, but um, this one's going to be at OA. Right, A right. great location. This is our second year there. It was so mm -hmm. much fun last year that we decided, uh, and they decided they were going to allow us to come back, uh, that we wanted to do it again there. Uh, it's a great location. Kind of keeps it a little bit uh, uh, in the southern part of the county, but, but yeah. centrally located still. So it's a great location, good venue for us. And people can still sign up, right? Absolutely. They can go to baldwinheartwalk.org mm -hmm. and um, still sign up, sign up for a team. Don't have a lot of time left, but still can get involved. And even if you don't want to sign up, you don't have to register to come out to the walk. You can still come out, join us that morning, lace up your shoes and move more with us. And there is a lot that goes on at these walks, too. You have information out there for people wanting to know more about heart disease. And every year it seems to be bigger. Yeah, absolutely. You know, and, and that's a good point that you make there. It's not just about the walk that mm -hmm. day. It's about educating people about what they can do to take control of their heart health, yeah. which has a fitness component, a nutrition component, a wellness and, and you know, de-stressing component. Yes. Um, there are lots of parts <laughs> to it, but that's what the heart walk is about, is just educating people and letting them know all these little things you can do that cumulative, cumulatively add up to better heart health in the end. Mm -hmm. What do you think um, most people will get in terms of the message? I mean, we always want them to lead a heart healthy lifestyle but other than that what do you want them to take away just that any physical fitness any kind of movement and that's why we say move more uh, it doesn't have to be running a, a half marathon you know if you can <laughs> did you say that because I had a race this yeah, past I, of course I did then, um, <laughs> <laughs> but if you just get out and walk even 10 minutes a day yeah. or if you do some yoga do little things they don't have to be high impact exercises those kind of things can benefit you so we just want people to do that take the stairs at work instead of the elevator uh, do these little things mm -hmm. that can really improve your heart health so if that's the one takeaway we would want people to, to leave with that, that, that's it and it seems a lot more local businesses are getting involved in supporting that message too absolutely everybody understands that heart disease and stroke remain two of the leading killers mm -hmm. of Americans and so it's incumbent upon all of us to kind of take a leadership role and step out and try to improve the overall health of our community you know I was listening uh, to a study the other day and it says right now women are the most stressed that they have been in quite some time just because of everything they're trying to juggle and that's leading to increased heart disease rates. Absolutely it is. Um, I think the, the stat is one in three women suffer from cardiovascular disease and, and that is driven by stress. It's driven by just not having the time of the day to do the very things we're talking about here um, such as uh, moving more, exercising, carving out time to get that zen moment in and mm -hmm. just kind of be well. So uh, yeah, it's definitely a problem for the whole population but specifically for women. All right, well we certainly want to see you out there you go. It's on your screen. November 16th at OA starts at 9 o'clock. Come on out, get some exercise, and learn more about how to take better care of your heart. Evan, thank you. Thanks for having me. All right, stay close because coming up,